Hey guys, how you doing? This is Dream of Siro here, here for another reading for the sign of Aquarius. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Greatly appreciated. Thank you for those who subscribe, those who recently subscribe, and those who subscribe in the near future. All is welcome, cross watchers. Grab a seat. Alright, I won't hold you guys any longer. Thank you, thank you so much for your continued lovely likes, comments, and shares, and continue subscribing to my channel. Alright, I don't think I've done a reading for you guys for this month. Um, this is, it's Aquarius season, so let's get to your reading. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. All right, there's no gender, no time and terror. This is why I highly recommend that you guys subscribe, subscribe. You just never know when you need to hear this, okay? All right, so the first card that flew out is Page of Wands. It's hard to pick up sometimes. Page of Wands. Ancestors, angels, universe, any messages you'd like for me to relate back to the sign of Aquarius, please and thank you. Happy birthday to those birthday has came. Okay. Or soon to come. Okay, that's been all right. We're going to come out. All right, so it's the Eight of Pentacles. The Death in Reverse. It flew out in Reverse. I don't think it was in Reverse, but it flew out in Reverse. So we're going to take it. Three more, please. Please and thank you. Right. Knight of Cups. Mm. The Knight, the Nine of, Nine of Swords and Eight of Wands. And that's in reverse. The Nine of Swords. And then the Eight of Wands. Overall, Queen of Cups in reverse. I'm hearing someone telling you, don't let them go. They want another chance. They want another chance, but how far is this chance going to last? This person has the tendency to live in the moment. Okay. Whatever comes to them, whatever helps them grow, you know, they like to, they like to do things, you know, but it's to an extent. They want to make sure they also have others helping them as well. For some reason, this person feels as though they pretend to have it together, but they, they, they're afraid to do it alone. This person keeps certain people close for a reason. I think you guys have went through a tower moment. And I think you guys went through a tower moment over an ex. And this is why now your person is now your ex. Someone wasn't being truthful of how they felt or that they were still communicating with this past person.
you know, the only reason why this person was communicating with this past person is because of comfortability of, you know, familiar, familiarity. But they regret it because this person hasn't changed. This is the reason why they left them in the first place. This is the reason why they stopped talking to them in the first place. And the only reason why you found out about it is because your person, who is now your ex, wanted to cut it off. That person did a lot of begging. And because of that, they felt insulted when your person kept telling them no. And this is why they get upset. Instead of getting upset where they're having sleepless nights, this is why the Nine of Cups is in reverse. Is because this person decided to handle their emotions in another way. In a vindictive way. It caused a lot of turmoil in this relationship because you you thought you knew your person. You know, in reality, your person was hiding the fact that they were t still talking, still making amends with their past person. Although this, I'm I'm having this feeling that your person also told you that you were they 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 wasn't even in speaking terms. You could care they they could have cared less about talking to them. But here we are. Here we are. I feel as though this past person never left. They stayed. Like they st they stayed waiting for your person. I think they, they even you know, I wouldn't say coerced because you can't make someone do something that they don't want to do. So your person did. Look further. Ancestors, angels, universe. Any other messages you'd like for me to clarify this page of wands? Mm. Seven of cups. <clears throat> Seven of cups. Out of all the people that your person have dated in the past, there's nothing compared to you. There was always something about these different people. One had a mask, okay, one was catfish, like they pretended to be. They always like had their hair a certain way. And then but when you really, really get to the needy greedy, this person that's what that's what that's what made them was the makeup, the hair, the heels, the you know, the the clothes. When all that came off, it was just a whole different person. And this person with this mask, you know, always pretending to be something that they're not. And the snakes, those who take the, you know, they had people who took from them. Those who felt like they were more royalty and more powerful than them. Then you got yourself some gold diggers who just wanted to continue to take. And, you know, mentally abuse your person in ways to keep them stuck in circles. <laughs> the person got burned, meaning burning. For some, might have caught some from, you know, from people from the past. Or they just, the fire that was in them, it was nothing, like, there was nobody that matched that. And so you came along, but instead your person did the opposite of what they were supposed to do. And I think it was out of fear. Out of abandonment. Because your person doesn't know what it is to be alone. Yeah, the tower moment, see? Can't make this up. It's something that already came already. Because it came in reverse, but I want to show you the effects that it had. It damaged a lot. Between y'all two. But I think this separation is going to teach you guys something about compromise. 
May yeah, five of cups in reverse. I don't feel like some of you guys are burdened by this. I think you guys sort of knew this was going on. You just needed it to come to light. Queen of Pentacles, yeah. You're hurt because you shared your dreams with this person. You manifested a lot of things with this person, but that doesn't mean that it's this is the end. For some of you guys, yeah. Y'all like, yes, it is, because if he could if he or she could lie about that, then we don't know what they can lie about. And five of swords. And that was in reverse. The magician. You do feel backstabbed. You feel betrayed. But this person didn't mean to hurt you. I know y'all probably like, what? Are you really gonna? Yeah, I gotta like say what it is. Like, that's not, that wasn't their attention. The fears that this person has. It has they have reasons. I've listed you seven, seven different heartaches. You know, not to say to give this person an excuse. There's no excuse to do what someone did to you. But this is why they hold on to certain things and don't know later on it's gonna bite them in the back, you know, in the in the back. Ten of Pentacles. This person wants to see longevity with you. But when it came into reverse, they're questioning if you actually really want to have the end all be all, the family dynamic with them. They're losing faith. They're losing faith because they, they, they know they did you wrong. And they know that honesty is really big for you. They have some type of, you know, faith, you know, um, I wouldn't say faith, but like they have some type of expectations that you may come back around, like, like wishful thinking, let's say that. And they're hoping that you do come back around because you are who they've been longing for. You are the the person that they've been wanting in their life. But this person has a pattern. They have a pattern. That's what I mean. Like, just because I say that they didn't mean to hurt you doesn't mean that what they're doing is okay. Or does it mean that they'll stop doing that? 1322, 322 on the clock as I stated that. Hold on just a second. Wait, hold on. Let me, can I even pause it? I don't even think I can pause it, so I'm not even going to do it. I'm not even going to do it. But let's look into this more further. I think I know what that, that sound is. So. And it says it's angels, you know, there's any messages you would like for me to relate that to the sign of Aquarius. Please and thank you. Alright. Two of Pentacles. Mm. Uh, confirms, yeah, the juggling. You, this per your person was juggling you and this past person and making sure that, you know, each other was happy. Yeah, seven of, seven of swords, this person, you feel like this person betrayed you. They, show, they showed some of their cards, they didn't show all of their cards. <laughs> and you're wondering if you could trust them again.
With the Six of Swords in reverse. You've dealt with a lot of heartache in the past. And this is exactly why you're standing firm in your beliefs on some of you guys walking away from this person. Some of you guys ain't sure you're in limbo. But don't only throw stones at their coffin. What lies beneath yours? Let's think about what we've done in the past as well, Aquarius. Have we, uh, you know, betrayed our, our own? All right. Eight of Wands. Stagnation. So you feel a sudden pull. Ten of Wands. This was definitely a burden for you because you didn't expect this person to keep such secrets. I feel as though you guys feel like they're hiding more than what they're telling you. And I hate to break it to you. They are. I think you guys are not asking the right questions. If there was ever a moment, I think this person probably took a trip somewhere or they 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 went ghost on you with this eight of swords. Like a, I'm, I'm hearing like a thief in the night. Like a thief in the night. <laughs> Five of swords, yeah. Have you also did your share of dating? Have you have you also you know entertained others as well? Nine of Pentacles. That confirms a yes. And that's for some of you guys. I know some of you guys are like, oh I'm faithful, I've been faithful, I've been faithful. Okay. Going out drinks with you know, and I'm uh, a co-worker that you don't, you wouldn't expect yourself to go out with during times that you and your person's not talking. Um, that's spending time. That's giving someone your attention and time. Okay. Um, it can be numerous of things. Um, being able to step out your comfort zone, like you see a neighbor or you see someone, you just step out and you just conversate with them and just, you know, you're laughing, you're joking and you where you would not even spend five minutes with them, you you notice that it's been 20 minutes, 25 minutes. Now we're here, it's an hour, okay? Now we're talking about what's for supper and what's going to be for dinner and, you know, who's going to cook and who's not going to cook, all right? Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. But I think you guys was both holding things back, but this person, um, there's one person, okay? Take what resonates that's been holding and suppressing a lot of emotions. Five of Pentacles, okay, for wanting their cake and eat it too. Some of you guys put them out. And they, you know, for this person to, to think, to think of what they've done. You know, you know some stuff of what they've done, but with this world card and this fool, this person took a lot of risk. Because of misunderstanding and thinking that you guys won't go back together again. Or you guys won't reconcile again. Now that, you know, they, they realize that there's nothing out there and the grass is not greener on the other side. Now they're regretting. Now they want to take back what it is that they've done. They do. 
Hold on a second. Hey, day. Turn that off for me, please. Turn it off. You'll see it. The stove. You'll see it. The stove. Yeah. I'm in the reading, please. Three more. Please and thank you. Please and thank you. This this has been dying to come out two of swords, and that's in reverse. All right. Your person no longer wants to deal with these the third party and all these extra people in in the the yeah. a lot of things transpire between those two people yeah you are who they want with the lover's card. Five of Wands, they were confused. They were conflicted. With this King of Wands and this Knight of Wands in reverse. You're confused yourself. You don't you don't know if you want to keep this person. You don't know if you want to continue because this person betrayed you. So you're conflicted. You're constantly in limbo of what is it you need to do. If you should move forward, give this person the chance and the opportunity. But you know, you know, Aquarius, it's not going to be easy for this person. Devil card here. Well, some of you guys are going to give this person a chance. And for some reason... This person is going to keep putting you in this karmic cycle until you start realizing that this person needs to grow on their own. You cannot help them. They can only help themselves. Yeah, five of cups in reverse. They spilled their own cups for people. They burned their own bridges with people because of their selfishness, their lack of responsibility, accountability. Yes, they they have the means to love someone. Yes, they have the means to allow someone to love them. But it's more to it. This person can at times just be on how they on their own frequency. Never mind anybody else. You're gonna meet your person, but not with this one. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. You're only losing. You're only losing. Yeah, look at three of swords. Shattered. Like, you, three third party situations, like, you're done. You're over with it. Temperance. Patience. The universe is asking you to be patient. Don't rush into it. Yes. Judgment. Those who've hurt you will soon feel and understand what it is to stand in your power. When you stand in your power... And you don't allow what people do to you, ricochet or change who you are as a person. You just continue to love and give, but just know you have some more more to do, and you have self respect, and you're not gonna allow anyone to just walk all over you. So you rather tell them bye, don't look back, and keep it moving. And the moment you start keeping it moving is when this person starts realizing just how much you mean to them. But for some of you guys, you feel it's too late. And for some of you guys, yeah, you'll give it another try. Until that's the last. 414, as I said that, 2414, but 414. You'll understand your path. You'll understand your purpose. And you'll understand why this person came into your life. Okay? I'm here and it was the peace to complete you. It wasn't the peace to complete you. It was the peace to help you, help you as a person find what your destiny, what you're calling for. And what love is and what love isn't. What would you allow to come and what would you allow to go? 
and not not hold on to something so much that you end up losing yourself in the in in the same breath of it all. I'm here to be kind. I know sometimes you guys may stress a lot, so you you got you filled with anger. You're edgy, you're anxious. Sometimes you just want to snap. Be kind. Be kind. I know sometimes it's hard and you'll be just wanting to just tell someone, you know what, just F off. I get it, I get it. But then you don't want to later on apologize later because, you know, you didn't mean it. But there's a lot of stuff that's building up on you, and it's a lot. That's a lot. Certain things are worth fighting for. And then there's certain things that are just going to keep you feeling one, one happy, then the next minute upside down. It's like a roller coaster. It's like an ending roller coaster ride. Uh, you know, not a fruitful one because you watered your plants and with this seven of pentacles in reverse, it's like you watered your plants and you let your plants grow and then all of a sudden the foundation is rocky. But I feel as though you're going to find your peace and it starts with you. It's not going to be easy though. It's not going to be easy. But I think y'all going to realize your peace matters more than being with someone who doesn't value you or someone who doesn't cherish you or someone who doesn't admire you in ways. They just pretend in the meantime. Yes, they've been through stuff. we all been through stuff. But you can't keep trying to teach someone that's not your job. It's not your job. You're going to keep exhausting, exhausting yourself trying to fill a void in this person. So it's going to, um, the storage is kind of low, so I don't want it to cut off. But yes, continue to do what it is you need to do. But think, think, think of yourself and what you can, what you can support and what you cannot support and don't let nobody take advantage of your heart your time your spirit and you okay be true to you first before you can be true to anybody else happy birthday again Aquarius till next time